What is going on Apex Legends glitch community? My name is Grunge Lamp Gaming and in today's video I'm going to be going over the top glitches in Apex Legends Season 7. There were a lot of cool ones, I'll be covering the top ones though, but there are some other videos of benign glitches, right? They don't hurt anyone, they're just these cool little things. And I'll leave a link in the description for those videos. But here are the hardcore ones, kind of interfering with the game. Let's get right into the video. Now the first one on this list today is the turbine map. So basically you can go under turbine with horizon and a trident. I'll show you guys how to do it in the video. In the video it clearly just shows running around. And I'll also be showing you in this clip how to get down to the turbine if you guys want to play around with the propellers they will insta kill you sometimes so just be aware of that but anyway it's super simple all you would do is drive up a trident use horizon to boost up the trident get in the trident while it's boosting into the ceiling and then get out of it and then you would get out of it but you would be in the ceiling and then from there you're able to walk around you used to have to do this with more than a couple people like you'd have to have a pathfinder with you to help you get down but with this I found a little crevice inside the wall and you kind of just shimmy your way down this wall into the turbine, the actual turbine itself. This is a really cool glitch. It is useful in ranked. This will buy you a little time. It won't buy you much. It is in the middle of the map and the ring usually never closes right here, but it is in the middle. So usually the ring will close somewhere in the middle for the first and second ring of the map. And that's about it for this glitch. This is one of the most easiest ones to do this season by far. Now for the second glitch on the video, this is a special one. This just came out towards the end of the season and boy, is this one the best one. Major creators everywhere are using this to the smallest creators. And this glitch is mind blowing. It is the most overpowering glitch we've had this season so far. And of course the rank split is not on Olympus, but you can see what I'm saying. Now basically, this is a rampart glitch. You guys will need to do what I do. Also have a video down below that helps you get in here if you guys need more explanation. But you basically wanna take your turret and put it next to the portal. And once this happens, you have to back into the portal while also jumping on the turret. Then you'll be stuck in a phase and then all you have to do is spam triangle and you'll eject out of the rift and under the map you are. There are no death barriers to my knowledge and you can pretty much walk anywhere you want. It is really OP and I hope they get this patch soon because when the rank split does occur next, it is going to be really awful for ranked players. This happened back on World's Edge and there was a huge ban wave, but looking past that, there's also a lot of people cheated out of their ranked wins. So beware of this glitch, it's super cool to do. It's actually really cool to look at the portal, what actually runs the portal system underneath the map. So just cool things like that. There's also a secret mirror down here, I'll have to make a video on that one day, but if you just run to the center under turbine, there's this little mirror that projects things that are up above the map. Now this last glitch was found at the end of season six, I know, right? It was never patched and no one really covered it. And even the video that I made on it, it did slightly well, but then it was taken down after EA started their witch hunt on glitches and bans like that on Icy Ops, and then everyone took down all their glitch videos. But now that it's safe enough to start making these videos again, this is this one. It is pretty much covered over. It's on World's Edge. It's literally the only glitch you can do on World's Edge that is in a big scale to this one. You guys will see me. It does take a practice. It took me an hour, a good 45 minutes to master how to get into this hole. It's very stressful and you have a time limit for getting in here. But once you do it, it the opportunities down here are pretty much endless. If you are Pathfinder, which you will have to be, you will get anywhere you want under the map in a good quarter of a half of the map. But you have to be fast and you have to know what you are doing. I'll also leave a link to a person who does a much better job at showing how far you can get down with this glitch. Now this is a clip that I'll be showing. It does a very good job of how to get in and that is the most important part in this glitch. This one was super OP but no one covered it and everyone took their videos down about it. So that's what ended up happening and no one really got anywhere with this during that time with EA striking down channels. So I encourage you guys to go try this for yourself. It's super fun and it's kind of a fun challenge to see what method works best for getting under the map in this little hole that you enter through. Cause trust me, 
it's kind of a pain. Well guys, what can I say except Season 7 really flew by. I don't know, it was kind of a filler season, but some major things did happen at the very start. Olympus, so definitely not a filler season, but towards the end, it became your normal Season 5. But anyway, thank you guys so much for the support on the channel. For some reason, the channel has been growing great. Season 7 has just been the season of growth for the channel. So let's keep on supporting it. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. For my subscribers, thank you guys so much. As always, thank you guys from the bottom of my heart because we're almost to 1,000 subscribers. And I can't wait to see that day very soon. I believe that will happen. So anyway, hope you guys have a great day. Take care, and I'll see you guys all later. Bye.